a look back at a story that greatly impacted us here at KETV and thousands of other people across the country. Casey Scharf survived a terrible car accident only to discover in the hospital she had cancer. But she looks at that crash as a blessing, the same way she now looks at her newest stage in life, become a young, becoming a young mother. Her eternal optimism, no matter what the challenge, is unforgettable. But was this accident in any way a blessing at all? I believe it was. I believe that God made, the, made it happen at that point in time because that's the point in time that I was strong enough to handle it. March 2013. Strength despite a broken back, broken neck, and learning just days after that crash, she had cancer. I'm determined to not let this cancer ruin my life or take it. That perspective inspired people all over the country to fight for Casey's cure. She received nearly $50,000 in donations. The National Institutes of Health contacted us hoping to help Casey. Three years later, Casey still has cancer, but believe it or not, that's not her main focus these days. What? Oh, you're gonna talk. This summer, 21-year-old Casey became a mom. The accident, like, of course, that wasn't like a great thing at first, but it ended up being a blessing. And a lot of people my age would kind of look at pregnancy and be like, oh, am I ready to be a mom? Like, this is kind of scary. But Casey remembers doctors telling her she wouldn't be able to have children because of cancer treatments. This face reinforces her belief in fate. You're tired, but you still get to wake up and see those smiles and see him so happy. She'll teach Malachi the same lesson she's already shared with thousands of others to stay strong no matter how hard the fight. I'm still fighting to this day, how many years later after finding out that I had cancer and I don't think that giving up is an option and I don't think that it should be for anybody either. Now again, Casey still has this rare form of cancer and she's already tried all of the available treatments. The good news is she's not getting worse and isn't feeling any side effects right now. Now, the cancer gene is also genetic, so doctors will monitor little Malachi throughout his life and test him for that gene as he gets older.